Hey guys, welcome to the seventh and final showcase I've got for my Death Guard army. What I'm going to be showing you today is uh, a few models I'm getting ready to um, to actually join the ranks of my army. First of all, we have uh, Young Mammon. Now, Mammon is the Forge World Demon Prince. He is a fantastic model, full of detail. Now, this one here, I didn't paint. What I'm actually going to do is I'm going to use a product called Simple Green and I'm going to take him back to his original colours and everything. Uh, I haven't used it on the Forge World resin. Um, I should probably give it a test first just to double check, but normally it works very, very well. Um, I'm going to take it back and I'm going to use it. I'm going to repaint him into, uh, into my colour scheme. And he should be absolutely beautiful. He's got little wings there, so he, it can just be used as a noble damn prince with wings. Second of, we've got another uh, Forge World product. Uh, this one here is a giant spawn, I believe. Uh, another beautiful model. Now he's not painted, he's getting there. I mean, the level of detail on these. You guys have seen Forge World gear before, and you understand. It takes a lot to get in there and paint them. It's really, it's a beautiful model. Not finished yet, gonna be fantastic when it's ready to go. Next what we have is actually the model that inspired me to uh, to get in and paint, well first of all make my um, my Chaos Bikers. I got this gentleman, I got the idea for my Chaos Bikers on horses uh, from this model. Now I got it, got all excited, got the horses to make my bikes and then I realised that he was tiny comparatively. Uh, so I actually had to go through and change my mind about how I was going to do it. Decided not to use this one. You probably see it's covered in white. I got a um, I got a pen. Basically, you rub over with, uh, and it makes it almost look like there's snow on the model. That's by Tamiya, I believe. That's why it's you know just been base coated and got the white on it. Sort of play. Now, so he was actually inspiration for my large chaos lord on a bike because well. He just wasn't up to scratch. Now, what else have we got? This one here is the another new addition to the army. This is Epidemius, I believe his name is. This is going to be basically my Chaos Nurgle Demons um, attachment for my Death Guard army. So he gives some amazing bonuses to, um, to anything with Mark of Nurgle. Uh, if you don't know his rules, you should definitely check it out in the Demon Codex. Uh, he's partly painted. I'm getting it ready. I'm gonna get a whole bunch of the new, uh, the new plague bearers and oh, the nerglings. I just love them. I'm gonna get involved in them. Now these here, I don't know if you guys have seen these before. I absolutely love them. Getting them prepped at the moment. This one here uh, is actually a Mortarian. Well, my interpretation of Mortarian. This was um, I cannot remember the the mini that I used as the base for this. It's it's very similar to the mini that it was before. Essentially, I just trimmed off the head and gave him a new one. Um, adapted a cape on green stuff and changed around how he's holding his scythe man reaper, I believe they're called. Uh, he is going to be absolutely beautiful. He's all painted up. There is quite a bit of detail on it, but. Again, all of these, once they're all ready to go, I can show you guys again at some later stage. So that's my Primark Mortarian. He's... I'll give you a scale. Um, compared to a standard Marine, he is very large. I don't know if you guys can see that there. The marine basically comes up just beneath his shoulder pad. Um, very large scale model. Now this one here is another uh, Mortarian that I got my hands on. Uh, now this one is, and obviously he's more of a demon form here, um, massive power fist. Now I have to just put him together. Now I sculpted a green stuff um, mask, I guess you could say, um, in front of his face because I couldn't, I didn't, didn't particularly like his new look. <laughs> so I decided to change it up a little bit. But again, these are all going to look very different once they're all finished, once they're all painted up. But they should be some really nice. Uh, additions to my to my death guard army all right guys let me know what you think uh, don't forget to rate comment and subscribe